All right, on to uh, 2.4, number 20 here. All right, 2.4, number 20. Um, it's actually similar to some of the stuff we were doing in uh, 2.3. might be a little bit more complex. The limit as t goes to 5 of 4t squared minus 100 over t minus 5. Um, so, again, I would like to maybe get rid of this 5 in the bottom, uh, this t minus 5, because right now, the problem is I can't put, I can't just do a direct substitution and put a 5 over here because I end up with a 0 in the denominator. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to kind of get rid of this 4 here first and say that this is equal to the uh, limit as t goes to 5. Uh, let me fix that real quick here, eraser. All right, there we go. And go to pointer pen. All right, so limit as t goes to 5 of, and I'm going to factor out that 4, so that 4 is going to come out and I'm going to get t squared minus 25, so 4 times t squared is 4t squared, 4 times negative 25 is negative 100, and I get that over t minus 5. Um, and now hopefully some of you might recognize this at this point, this is the difference of squares, um, which is just a limit as t goes to 5, uh, 4, times the difference of squares is t plus 5, t minus 5. And if you don't believe me on that, you can do a real quick uh, t times t is t squared minus 5t plus 5t, so there is no center term, but then 5 times negative 5 is negative 25, um, over t minus 5. You'll notice now you actually got a t minus 5 that goes away, and this becomes the limit as t goes to 5 of uh, just 4, 4 times t plus 5, um, which would be equal to, uh, let's see here, limit as t goes to 5, so I'm going to substitute in a 5 there, uh, 4 times 5 plus 5, which is equal 4 times 10, which is equal to 40. That's going to be my limit right there. And that's 2.4 number 20.